Uh, former the Tigers, uh, the Tigers players and some domestic players have warned the sports ministry against going ahead with the January 31st elections in Benin into the board of the Nigerian Basketball Federation (NBBF). The players, led by former Cleveland Cavaliers and the Tigers player EJK Obwaja, vowed to resist the imposition of any candidate on the players as president of the federation. Obwaja said the players must be considered in decisions that concern them as they can be no federation without the players. Victor really completes the story. Four years after crisis engulfed the Nigerian basketball family, no meaningful progress has been made toward resolving the impasse. Ahead of the January 31st elections in Benin, the basketball family remains as divided as it was in 2017 leaving watchers wondering what has been the role of the supervising ministry in resolving the lingering face-off. FIBA is not Nigeria, and we're not scared of ban for them to ban us. So as it stands today, if they force a president on us, we're going to ban ourselves from playing basketball. He, he will not lead us anymore. As far as I'm concerned, the domestic league have been unbanned for the last four years. Because we have not really paid anything. We have not played anything in the last four years, so it's as good as we have, we have been on ban. I think ministers should be more concerned uh, for the players that are saying they will not play under a particular uh, person than the FIBA that they are afraid of. The way and manner the sports ministry has gone about the crisis and the forthcoming elections have left much to be desired with the players and daggers drawn with the ministry over its inconsistencies and disregard for them. We're crying to the minister, but if the minister refused to listen to us, I think we're going to make a big statement to Nigerians in sports. But we hoped on them for the whole time that they will resolve these issues and make things work in the good and interest of the Nigerian basketball player. And if as at now they don't do that, then honestly speaking, the, the, the minister of sports has really failed us. As far as I'm concerned, we have not even been notified. Because the, they are just selecting their friends and sending them messages for invitation, which is very, very wrong. This is like taking opportunities away from a lot of players. And um, I don't think we, we really like it. The MBBF election was earlier fixed for Abuja by the ministry, but in a surprise twist, the ministry kept mute on the decision of the outgoing president, Musa Kida, to hold the elections in Benin, even as the players threatened to boycott any further international engagements. From Abuja, Victor Irele reporting for Silverbed News 24.